Chris Kennedy here with a quick real estate market update. Not even I would have guessed that the pace of this market would be this fast compared to last year with the whole pandemic. During the pandemic, there was a 35% decrease in the amount of market activity back in March and April. We're already way past our numbers from last year. And if we stay on this track, 2020 will have more sales compared to 2019, which is just incredible. Sale price averages are also up 13% year over year. Buyers don't let this deter you from going out shopping because interest rates are extremely low and it still makes homes more affordable. I'll explain more in a little bit here. First, let's take a look at why the market is moving at such a fast clip. The market is moving so fast for a few reasons. One is there was obviously a ton of pent up buyer demand and now those buyers are out shopping in full force. Additionally, a lot of people are able to work from home or work remote. So people are moving around and moving to larger homes from big cities. And so it is the same reason that we love living here in Florida is the same reason that many home shoppers are out looking to relocate to Florida and they are. And finally, the interest rates are extremely low. Interest rates are currently at about 2.86% at the time of this video, which is just absurd. It makes home buying extremely affordable, even when factoring an increase in sale prices. Let's take a look at the graph just to compare what it might have looked like a year ago to what it looks like now. We'll look at a $300,000 sale price with a 3.5% interest rate, similar to what we saw last year. And on the right side, we'll see a $330,000 sale price with a 2.86% interest rate. All other terms the same. The mortgage is only $16 more a month and maybe insurance and taxes go up a little bit. We're talking about a $50 difference. That's pretty insignificant. Homes are still affordable. Take advantage of the 2.86% interest rates or the low interest and get locked that in for the life of the loan. It is a good time. In more exciting news, Derek Jeter has just listed his home. It's also the rental for Tom Brady. So if you're in the market for a huge estate on the water, that might be one to check out. It's only $29 million right now. And Shaq has also listed his home in Orlando or Windermere. It's absolutely massive, 31,000 square feet. It looks like it needs a bit of renovation. So if you're in the market for an estate and you do not want to renovate, I'd probably stick with Tom Brady's home. And now what's fun is I can absolutely help you with either one because the Chris Kennedy team has expanded to Orlando. That's right. Check out my new website, orlandochris.com. And if you have any inquiries in real estate for Orlando or Tampa, the Chris Kennedy team is here to help. Thank you guys for watching this. If you want to see any more stats or infographics, check out the blog if, it's, if you're not already there. And I will see you guys on the next one. Stay safe.